welcome to California Adventure. It's me, Lisa, happiest vegan on Earth. And I would like to do an update today because Festival of Holidays has been going for a little while. I already made a video about it before um, on the first day it opened, but you know how it is like on the first day it opens? Sometimes it's like not as good as later. It seems like they have improved the recipe on this. Um, this is the Impossible Arepa Encantada. And um, you saw me eating it in the video before and I was like, it's pretty good, you know? Like I enjoy it and I recommend it. But we had it again the other night um, and it was like so much better than the first day um, because there's a different vegan cheese situation here. I'll show you in a minute. Um, it, it lists vegan cheese on the on the description of it and when I was first eating it, I was like, I'm not really detecting the vegan cheese, but I guess it's there somewhere. Um, maybe like baked into the corn cake. So basically the arepa is a corn cake um, you know, like a, like a crab cake, but a corn cake, so it's cornmeal. And then we've got impossible meat on the top there. So it's got this impossible meat on top of it, and it's mixed with a bunch of spices and stuff, and like olives too. So, um, the major difference from before is that we're gonna have a bunch of vegan cheese in there that I was not noticing on the first day. So let me just get in the middle here. Okay, so hopefully you can see on the inside now, there's a bunch of vegan cheese in the middle that I don't remember um, tasting or seeing at all um, the first time I got it. So it's like that corn cake and then on the middle is totally filled with that vegan cheese. And so it is um, super good this way. It like really takes it to the next level. So yeah, we can get a bite with some of the arepa and some of the impossible meat mixture on top. Yeah, all the vegan cheese on the inside really takes it to the next level. And the pickled onions. There's olives in there, so if you don't like olives, it might be a thing, but I really like the olives in here too. Super good. So um, if you are in California Adventure, I would highly recommend you come get this. I recommend it more than I did before. And also at Paradise Garden Grill, they have a chili ray. I know that's very good. Right now, this Impossible Arepa is from the Grandma's Recipes booth, which is right there. Um, and then this is the only vegan thing from the booth. And then Paradise Garden Grill has that full-size meal, which is the chili ray, you know, which is also very good. If you want the full the full rundown on um, everything that's vegan at Festival of Holidays and all the different holiday foods, um, and of course the complete guides to everything, not just the seasonal stuff, but like the normal stuff, all around Disneyland, NDCA, and Downtown Disney and the hotel, that's all in my blog. It's all linked below. So I hope you enjoyed this little update. And until next time, I'll see you real soon.